All right, here we go. We got the men's 100 meter dash. This is the 2021 Kenyan Olympic trials, right? This year, we have, when we look at the rankings, all right, we're gonna look at the Kenyan rankings in the 100 meter dash. The number one guy is Ferdinand Omanyala Omuro in lane three, and in lane four, we got Mark Otieno, one and two in the country this year. Boom, here we go, the start of the men's 100 meter dash. Again, Omanyala 10.01 10 this year, Otieno 10.1. Boom, all right, it looks like Omanyala just took took this dub. Omanyala went 10.02, all right, 10.02. Marco Tino went 10.05 in that, Okot Benson went 10.51 in fourth. Adome Pius went 10.55 in fifth. Oduor Ochieng went 10.58 and in sixth, Chege Waweru went 10.6, all right. And we had two DNS, Brown Joker and Orogot Tarsis. Anywho, again, only one man, Omanyala, who just won, hit the Olympic standard, right? 10.05 or faster is the Olympic standard. He came in with a 10.01, he just ran a 10.02, all right? Legal wind, his 10.01 was plus 1.4. And then Marco Tenio came in with a 10.11. And he just ran a 10.05. That's he just got the Olympic standard. So we're gonna have two Kenyans representing uh, two men representing Kenya in the 100 meter dash. All right, and I think this is the first time ever. If I'm not mistaken, this is the first time ever this has ever happened. I don't even think we've ever had a Kenyan 100 meter dash sprinter in the Olympics. So again, 10.01. Omanyala said his goal was to to drop a sub 10 but he didn't get it it doesn't matter he he gets to represent kenya in the 100 meter dash something that has never been seen so this is wonderful 10.02 and 10.05 wow down to the wire down to the wire omanyala was born on august 3rd 1996 all right so he's He's in his prime right now. And Marco Tino is actually three years older. The guy that got second, he's three years older than Omanyala, who just got the dub. So that's awesome, man. 